Hello, my name is Raymond Friend, and this is the beginning of the process to turn an old barn frame built in the 1840s that I disassembled 10 years ago to be turned into a house. Now we finally have the resources to put this beautiful timber frame barn back up. So in this series of videos, we are going to show you how to turn a barn frame into a house. In this video, we are starting with our footers. This is to make sure that it has a good foundation. So we are creating these footers and Larkin is helping me to make sure they are all leveled all the way around. This is where the concrete will go in. Some of our goals for this project include helping our kids learn some practical skills and the value of hard work, rescuing a historic structure and giving it a new purpose, using as many reclaimed materials as possible, and making our home energy efficient and sustainable as possible using advanced technologies that work well with our timber frame structure and our local climate. As you can see, I've got some big helpers. So much so that they need to take breaks. We gotta go swim in the creek. In this picture, you can see where I'm putting footers here because this is where the post will go up to hold the second story. My boys are in there making sure that everything is lined up before we pour the concrete. Here comes the concrete. I had some of my workers who helped me with my uh, projects to come out so we could do this all in one, one afternoon. The concrete was fairly simple when we only had to do the six inch footers around the backside where there's going to be backfill and so we did not have to worry about the frost and the thawing. had to use a Georgia buggy to get the concrete to the central footers. The next step was to pour the concrete for the footer that is going to be on the walkout side of the basement. This means that it does need to be deeper to get past the frost line. And the concrete wanted to spill the sides, so we had to use extra concrete. But all in all, it turned out and it looked fabulous. this next video, we had to line up and make, use string and measuring tape to make sure that the ICFs, which will be in the next episode, are going to be completely square so the barn frame can sit on top of them. In our next episode, we will be putting up the ICFs. These are insulated concrete forms and will be the walls of our basement. 